ABC has been uh, more of a constant than many of the jobs that I've held. Uh, I have uh, a relationship with IABC that goes back about 20 years, so um, it's been there through uh, thick and thin and job ch uh, changes. Um, but it, early in my career, IABC certainly played a very um, pivotal role in terms of me understanding more about what communication, uh, the communications industry was and, and what it could be. Uh, and in the early days, I certainly um, took advantage of the opportunity to speak to those people who had far more experience than I did in, in different industries. Uh, what I found about IABC is that it's uh, always been a place for me to go and uh, test what I know, test what I'm working on, uh, to find out and learn more about uh, best practice and um, developing trends within the industry. And so uh, that's, that's, that's great value. I feel that uh, you know communications as a profession um, is very important, and I think it's maybe no more important. It's, it's as important now, if not more so, than it ever has been. Uh, the challenges that we're faced with, in terms of representing the organizations that we work for, um, continue to increase as audiences get more diffuse, um, as our need to be uh, accountable and more of a dialogue rather than a, a one-way communication uh, stream or, or channel uh, continue to, uh, to uh, increase. So um, the great thing about the industry is that it's always changing. Um, you've got to work a little bit extra hard to make sure that you're keeping up with, uh, with what's going on, but uh, the rewards are certainly um, immense. Uh, and you know, I really can't think of a, uh, of, a, of a stream of work that I would have preferred to have gotten into. So uh, congratulations to IBC London locally for uh, their 40th anniversary. Uh, and here's to all of us uh, continuing to contribute to the industry um, as communicators uh, moving forward. All the best.